In this video, I want to go ahead and make a checkbox in I'm GUI that's going to control whether or not we draw our own team. So if we have it checked, we want to see our team in our ESP or our snap lines. If not, then we don't draw them at all. We just ignore it. So we're going to go ahead and set that up. First thing I want to do is actually create the checkbox. So we're going to do that right here. So actually, let's do that right above our exit button. That makes more sense. So the way it's going to go is I'm GUI checkbox. It has the name, so what it is. So in this case, it's going to be show team. Or let's just do team visible. And then it has a pointer to a Boolean that's going to be kind of our uh, our control Boolean for this. So that's going to be up here. So we're going to do bool b show team equals, let's do false by default. So this is our control Boolean. So that's going to be address of, and there we go. So this checkbox, well, you'll see. So I press F5. Here's our checkbox. As you can see, it's unchecked by default. You can check it, uncheck it. But if I go ahead and I change B show team to true, so that's its value by default for starting. Now you can see it's checked by default. So it's used for control. So I want to have it set to false. Now I want to go ahead and we will do that right here. So we're going to do a check. So if entity team equals local team and actually let's see here yeah we're gonna create just a boolean for it so bool on same team equals entity team equals local team we're gonna use that for stuff here in a minute so if on same team and what was it b show team so if we're on the same team and we do not want to show the team, so our checkbox is unchecked, we want to continue. After that, that kind of indicates that we are on the same team. So we're just going to do the same check. So if on the same team, you know, do what we need to do. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to go ahead and run it. Team visible. I check it. Now it shows the snap lines. Uncheck, check, check, or uncheck, check. So that's working just fine. Uh, that's yeah, that's actually all I had written down for this video. I wouldn't expect it to only be like three minutes, but uh, let's see. Is there anything I can do like to kill more time? Uh, not that I can think of. So I guess that's gonna be it for this one. I mean, like I said, like with I'm GUI, it's it's flat out effortless to make your own stuff like your own menu and all that kind of stuff very very quickly uh yeah that's pretty much everything so yeah i'm just gonna leave it here screw it uh anyway this video is done and if you like what i'm doing and you want to help support me blah 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 patreon in the description make a, a team deathmatch tutorial series for patrons only if you have any questions link to the discord it's in the description as well uh, there might be one more video after this or a couple i'm not entirely sure i'm trying to think of what else to do because that's that's mostly what i wanted to get done heck i have no idea what else to really do because that pretty much covers everything i needed so yeah well, if there's another video after this yeah i, I don't know anyways adios simple enough